they're not going to work. They're not going to work. Hey, I'm Jack Miller from Married at First Sight, season nine. And today I'm going to be ranking the 2023 maths couples. See how we go. So I'm going to rank these couples basically in the likelihood of how they're going to work out. If they'll work out, I don't think these guys are going to work out. Let's be honest, it's been a week for Dan and Zan. She seems lovely. She seems nice. He seems like Dan. So they're going to stay down the bottom. We've seen a lot of the next couple. Season favourite, isn't he? Harrison? I don't think they'll last. Ironically, I think they've kind of bonded at times and they do kind of have moments, but in terms of lasting, um, I know especially a lot of stuff came out about her saying she kind of knew him before and knew of him. There was that whole debacle, so bottom. Just to sort of clarify, we've got the no line. Not gonna work, not a chance. We've got the maybe line, and then we've got the Hail Mary line. And we hope for this one. Because of all the stuff that has come out, I'm just gonna do it. After this week's events, forward slash all of the extra media that has come out about these, well, specifically her, I don't think they're gonna work. I think we already know they don't work. It's just been released already. Isn't that sad? We shouldn't know that, but we do. Okay, okay, okay. How long does this no line go for? Can we just keep it rolling? Look, I don't think these two are gonna work. I think they have moments where they I kind of look at them and I think they kind of get along, which is ironic, but they are really, really not seeing eye to eye to a point where See You Next Tuesday has been released into the world. Oh, Taylor and Hugo. They started so strong. Not really. We're now gonna hit the maybe column. I like this guy. Not only because he is a good looking human, but honestly, I haven't seen enough of their relationship as a whole. You know, they've got little bits to say, but I haven't really seen them. So maybe, maybe. Evelyn and Rupert. Now I do like to hope that he does have more words than, because I, 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 I think he might. All right, the maybes continue. I just don't know enough about this fella to dictate it. I'm changing this up a bit. So I'm not gonna put any more on the maybe line, but I'm gonna change what the yes line means. And the yes line for me means that even though they may not come out as a, in a relationship, they may chuck a Dom and Jack and give it a crack. That rhymed. <laughs> I'm cool with that. Look, these two seem like they just get along like a house on fire, so they all seem very bubbly. It's not really much more I can say about those two, but the prodigal couple. One who has done so much wrong. One who is so very strange. She has made a huge mistake. We all know it. Don't like her for it. I think that you really should give this experiment a red hot crack. But they're gonna sit somewhere between the maybe and the, in the, and this section, right? I'm gonna explain my ways. She really didn't get along with him early on. He really didn't like her early on. And then some mistakes were made and that's the current drama that is unf unfolding before our eyes. I think they oddly get along. They do get along. We've seen it on TV. But I just think that they will at least remain friends for a long time. And the only chance that a couple is there. So, week five, rankings have been made. Please, feast your eyes. Maybes, nose. No one saw this no coming. Mm-mm. But yeah, here we are. 